Hi, and welcome to your Potterful tutorial for March. We are gonna get started with our mozzarella ball, so you can go ahead and take that out of the wrapper. For the mozzarella ball, we are going to just slice it. You can slice it into about quarter to half inch slices, and then I'm just going to place it in a bowl so that the liquids stay within the ball um, and don't get all over your board. Next, we are gonna do the smoked fontina. Go ahead and take that out of the wrapper. For this one, you'll notice it does have the casing, but we are not going to use that for placement. We are simply going to cut this as you would a pie and just cut it and keep cutting it in half so that you get eight little wedges. And we'll use those to make a fun placement on our board. Lastly, we have our cheddar. For this one, go ahead, take it out of the wrapper, and we are just going to slice it. It's really nice and stays together nicely, so we're just going to slice it, and this is going to, for our large boards, it's gonna allow us to do a little weave up our board, um, which is really nice and pretty for a placement. So just slice this one, nice and simple. First, for our meat, we are going to cut our Genoa salami chub. This is in our large kits. Um, very simple here. Just go ahead, take it out of the wrapper. There is a casing on this. So how I like to take that off is I cut off the tip and then I will use my fingers to pull it up and then I can use scissors to cut um, that casing off. And then just slice it as you normally would. For our peppered salami, we are first going to turn those into a rose, so lay out about six, seven pieces of salami overlapping, and then you're gonna fold it up like a taco about three quarters of the way up, not fully halfway. And then from one edge to the other, you just roll it nice and tightly into a cute little rose, just like that. I do make two roses for my board, but in this tutorial, I am just gonna show you the one, um, a little tip here is that I do use sometimes a little bowl. So you do get two little bowls in your kit. You can use those to put the rose inside to really help it keep its shape. Um, you can also just use it to pin up against a cheese like you see I do in the video. Also for the pepper salami, we are gonna do a little half moon. Um, super cute, it lines up nicely around a jam. So we are just going to take it fold a piece in half, fold it in half again so it's in fourths, and then you just line them up. And then as you do that, it'll create this really nice um, curved shape. Now we will build the boards. So up first, we'll do the standard board. And then if you got the large kit, you can actually skip ahead to that build. 